이 자리는요 KSF 드라이버 분들과 저희 어, 현대 쉘 어, 월드 엘리팀 드라이버를 초청하여 자동차 드라이빙에 관해 서로 소통할 수 있는 자리를 마련했습니다. 2014 시즌 영상을 한번 보도록 하겠습니다. 2014 Uh, we had not uh, enough time to develop the car. We started only one or two months ago to drive first time with the car. So uh, for next year, uh, of course, our aims are to get more victories. Uh, being uh, towards the end of the year with the new car, uh, quite competitive. And then uh, the main goal is 2016 to, to achieve the title. Of course, uh, the car we are using for the moment is not developed to the maximum because uh, we are more focused on the new car. But uh, the strength for me is uh, the chassis, which is uh, giving a good stability on the, on the, on the gravel roads uh, because it's quite long and uh, you can carry on a lot of speed, uh, speed into the corners. Uh, the weakest point for the moment is the uh, engine. Uh, we, we struggle a lot uh, with engine power compared to the other uh, cars, to the other manufacturers, so uh, that's why Uh, on some rallies, we, especially on tarmac, we, we had difficult to follow them. Uh, okay, we were quite, uh, we had a quite good rally in Germany, but all the other tarmac events we were quite far behind on times. Uh, and then some other rallies, when it's very fast and you don't need to brake a lot, then we were quite okay. So we could really see that on engine we need much more power. Yeah, we have some accidents sometimes, but never a big accident like I was seek after no? uh, you always have uh, small uses like uh, I don't know but it's, it's part of the job because you uh, the rally is um, sometimes you need to take risks for, for, for being the others and, and uh, well, normally you need to, to take risks so you, you work, when you take risks it's very easy to, to make a mistake but uh, in my career I didn't have uh, many many crashes The safety is doing more for business, you know, it's not only in my home and doing, of course it's, uh, it's, it's, it's for me and my family, business, and uh, we, we drive sometimes in the, in the safety, but it's, it's okay, it's good, it's very good for initiation in the car, in, in, in the cars, but it's not, uh, not the same than the, than the rally cars, no? but of course it's, it's good fun and uh, It's better to do karting at the beginning of the when you are very young because you will take a feeling with the with the steering, with the pedals, with everything. And, and it's, it's very good uh, initiation. But the only thing is uh, they, they start very well in the kart. I think it's, it's very very good start for for be a, a good driver. I think it's like everybody is starting in karting and they they need to. To stay training a lot of the time and, and fix an uh, objective and have to, to train and train all the time. You know? I, I had the chance uh, on the uh, Motorsport Festival to discover a little bit the, the competition in Korea. Uh, I think some of you I have already seen there, some of you are driving. So, uh, of course, it's quite different compared to, uh, to Europe. Uh, Uh, if you compare the track already, because it was a city track at uh, this time, uh, which is completely different, much more bumpy, uh, and and even a bit more dangerous, I would say, because there's no safety. Uh, but uh, yeah, it was it was interesting to see. Of course, the cars are, I would say, uh, well prepared, but still quite basic. 
because it's uh, I think original engine and uh, and gearbox. Uh, so of course there could be done a step to get some more race feeling. Uh, and then what's always important when you are driving is that you have a lot of competitors with a lot of fights and uh, and this is the most important for for learning for the learning curve. So I think this was done. I have seen uh, many many cars. Uh, huge competition, so uh, it was interesting to see, and and as well the people seems to love it. So this is important uh, to grow up in a in a, in a career. Of course, uh, I was driving since six years in rallying. I uh, started uh, quite young, and uh, as a as a driver, your aim is always to sign up with a manufacturer one day. And uh, okay, I got the chance between different manufacturers, but uh, for the moment the biggest ones are Hyundai and Volkswagen. Uh, and for me, uh, the choice was quite clear that uh, Hyundai has uh, has the facilities in Germany as well to to develop a good car, has the budget, and uh, has as well, uh, yeah, the, the ambition to do very well. Uh, it's a very young manufacturer, and uh, which wants to show, especially uh, as well uh, in Europe, uh, what they are able to do and. Uh, uh, so I was quite convinced that with Hyundai we could do quite well. I knew that the 2014 season uh, would be very difficult. Uh, even the beginning of 2015 will be difficult. But as soon as the, the, the new the, the new i20 is coming, uh, I think we will be at the top and uh, have to fight for victories every race. I have, because for me it's uh, it's very interesting what we're doing at the moment. Before the project was was really nice, but, uh, and I, I speak with the with the whole team, and um, after I saw they are really motivated for, for doing something very important in rally. So already this year, I think all the team and the drivers are doing very good job. So with the car completely completely new, so I have a lot of confidence for the future for, for next year and. With the new car, we will start with the with this with this car, but at the uh, in the middle of the season a little bit more we we'll change the car. So I have a lot of confidence in the new car. Yeah, of, of course. Uh, I think uh, it's a long-term contract. I have signed with Hyundai, and uh, we we of course uh, yeah for me it's some some kind of security as well. And I'm sure uh, I can uh, develop something with the team from the beginning. Uh, to the to the highest level of competition. Uh, and after, because uh, we need the license for life for drive and rally. So before that, we we are starting something like karting or something like this. So before my license drive, I have some some karting races or something like this. And after when I was uh, the license, I started in, in the rally in the regional championship. And after the Spanish championship, and after. And for me it was a bit different. Uh, I only started uh, when I was 19, uh, so yeah, about uh, seven years ago. And uh, I, I did any karting before, just some for private driving, but not never in competition. Uh, but I always loved uh, rallying, so uh, I, I started very early driving by, with the cars at home and uh, on the field, and like this I, yeah. I, I learned driving and uh, then one day I got the chance to participate in a rally in 2008 and uh, yeah, I had a very good season in Belgium, uh, I was supported by the Belgian Federation and so I, I grew up step by step uh, to the WRC. I think for me rallying is still one of the, of the, of the best sports because uh, you are driving a lot. We are driving on different surfaces, we drive on tarmac, we drive on snow, we drive on gravel. Uh, we are visiting many different countries, we are busy all year by testing. It's something what, what I, I really like. Now, uh, of course Formula 1 could be nice, but uh, I, I have some friends actually who have done Formula 1 and uh, who are getting to Formula 1. Uh, and I know if you want to get there, uh, you need to bring millions of budget to be able to drive and uh, I don't have this budget and uh, I I always was more focused on rallying because uh, many friends before were doing rallying and uh, rallying is very famous in Belgium as well so uh, I, I enjoyed much more watching rallying than Formula 1.
as strategy, I think when we start in, uh, when you are young, the only strategy is to, to drive as fast as you can and show your speed. This is the most important in the beginning to see uh, or to show everybody, okay, there's someone who's young, who has not a lot of experience, but who is already very fast. And uh, so you get in contact with different teams and you can grow up, you got support by federation, which is very important as well and on, on the beginning. And after that, of course, uh, one day you, you have to be fast, but as well reliable. And then you're starting to, to work more on this side, uh, being more consistent, getting, of course, more experience, because in rallying experience and knowledge of the, of the different countries and roads is quite important, the different surfaces. And after this, it's getting like kind of rhythms, but of course you have to work always on yourself, uh, on the car as well, because you need to be one with your settings uh, if you want to be fast and reliable. So it's quite uh, quite a big job. It takes time because you need the experience over over many years, and then uh, for negotiations things like this, of course uh, every driver is using some manager, or the most of them are using manager. And uh, yeah, they help you to, move, to, to make the contact with the teams and the contracts. Yeah, I think the motivation is clear. My dream was always to get a valid driver. Huh? And then uh, when you are motivated and you are fighting for it, you, you, like I said, you go up step by step every year, a different team, a better car, a, a different championship until the WRC championship. And then, uh, of course, after you have to get uh, uh, reliable, fast, and uh, show your speed to get uh, to get a contract with a team. And then, uh, from that moment, of course, you are a professional driver. Uh, I stopped working. Uh, working. Uh, I, I after school actually I did work uh, one and a half year, and after this I stopped working only to be focused on rallying. And uh, since then, yeah, I, I it was difficult time in the beginning because I didn't uh, gain any money. But then uh, I had some sponsors and we were able to get to the World Championship, World Championship uh, to gain some money and now I can live uh, by driving. I, 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 of course, the, uh, the aim at one day for every driver is to be World Champion. Uh, first of all, our focus is of course as driving for manufacturer to get the manufacturer title and then after you have to focus on, on the driver's title as well. So this is the, the biggest aim every every driver has and uh, this is why we are working so hard and focusing on. For me a little bit the same, and you will explain, you know, of course, uh, the same history. When you start in driving, in rally, you, your dream is to be a professional and to, to be world champion. And to be world champion, you need to be in an in a official team and, and be professional uh, rally driver. And it's a really, it's really a dream of, of every driver I think, to, to do that. Um, I think we both are very really lucky to, to have this position and this, this job. So I think I am very, very proud and very happy with him also, I think. Like, uh, like Danny said already, uh, we started with karting. Uh, so it's a good school for everybody to, to get some further experience. For me, it was a different case. Uh, uh, by, of course, uh, driving with the cars uh, on the field. Uh, I did a lot of quad driving at home as well. So, uh, yeah, after this, you have a, uh, you need to have talent, of course. If you don't have talent, you will never be a fast or very fast driver. And then, over the experience, you get faster and faster. Uh, as you know more your car, or your car, you, you get more confident and you get faster as well. And, uh, and then, at the end, it's not to be fast, it's to be faster than everybody else. And this is hard work for, for every driver, try to be faster. You have to work, especially in rallying, to work a lot on your pace load system, which is this driving the road you are driving, uh, and uh, do as much testing as you can to have the best setup. Uh, because if you want to beat the others, you need to have the perfect setup, the best pace nodes, and uh, a good understanding between driver and co driver. So all this, you, you have to work in it. It takes time, you cannot do it from one day to the other, you need a few years of experience. We don't have winter season, we already uh, have this, after the next week we have testing for Rally Monte Carlo, the week after we have testing for Sweden, after the presentation for the team, and in January we have one day testing at the beginning of January, and the first uh, week of January we have already Rally Monte Carlo, and after you 
all the time again, all the time to come. Not holiday. <laughs> it's quite different uh, rallying compared to race, okay? But I know uh, Hyundai uh, has the huge intention to, to find a Korean driver as well for World Rally Championship, but uh, of course uh, it will take some time to, to find because the story of rallying in Korea is very unknown and, uh, and there's not so much competition. Uh, or on, especially on gravel and snow in Korea, so uh, the, I think uh, if if Hyundai has the attention or they have the attention to, to find the Korean driver, of course they, they should do some testing with the actual circuit driver and see who is the best talent and uh, uh, and try to, to develop one of those guys uh, and get them some chances to drive in rally in Europe uh, to, to learn a bit more. Uh, what is rallying, uh, how to work, but uh, of course it will take uh, uh, one or two years of development before the driver can reach quite a good speed. The world's best WRC 우승한 선수들을 이렇게 실제적으로 만나게 돼서 영광이었고요. 일단은 제가 옆에서 통역을 하면서 정말 아, 이분들이 그래도 선수들이지만 그래도 인간성이 넘치는 선수들이다. 그리고 이제 앞으로의 뭐 WRC를 뭐 책임져 나갈 그런 선수인 것 같고요. 현대 팀에 있어서 정말 어, 앞으로도 역사를 이룰 것 같은 선수인 것 같습니다. 그리고 정말 좋은 기회였던 것 같습니다. It was very, very nice event. We, we meet a lot, a lot of people uh, asking, asking questions in, in this area, lovely area from, from Germany. So we are very happy to, to be here to, to help the question of the, of the fans, of the other drivers, and uh, to, to sign some, some autograph and to see the, the people happy. No? I think this is nice to do small events like this. Yeah, hello to all the Korean fans and uh, thank you for inviting us again. Uh, it's actually my third time in Korea. I'm enjoying every time and it's nice to see uh, so, so many people uh, knowing each time more and more about rallying. So uh, thank you and uh, yeah, some, some, some good drivers as well, uh, which we have seen during the year uh, on some circuit competition. Next year we're going to be part of the competition, so uh, take care, we, we're going to be fast. <laughs>